Titans are the leading receivers on your team. You can tell me after this play. First down and 10, Payne in the backfield. Off the play action, great ball handling, and Sewell does that well, completing the pass to another one of his tight end. That's the second one we talked about, Jonathan Stubar. And he also had some injuries at wide receiver, Mark. Uh, this uh, attack born out of necessity. This is Simpson with a good burst over the 35. Simpson on the loose, and another Virginia first down. Pun intended. This goal didn't attempt the field goal from 36 yards out, and the guy that has made two consecutive game-winning field goals knocks through another one here. You say a California kid, and you kind of think of what that is. That's what this is. And he's talking about scuba diving yesterday, cracking jokes with Ralph Regan. He is very uh, earthy and organic. He described it that way. And he completes a pass. He's on target. That's what he is, too. That is Hayward Bay with the catch. Against the run. They truly two gap and play technique inside. Virginia without a fullback this time, and it's Lattimore touchdown, Turks. With all that controversy going on around you, and he was able to right the ship and get this team six straight wins. They're approaching by Grill and Payne still on his feet. Out across the 40 to the 42 yard line. Crazy goings on in college football this year as we approach the midway point. Nice run by Payne. And Payne across the 40 to the 39-yard line. Of guys like Hayward Bay with 10.2 speed in the 100. Lance Ball in the backfield. Lance Ball getting a touch. And got a nice block on the ISO play, actually. First down and 10 coming up. And another good gain. Lance Ball all the way down to the 13-yard line. First and goal from just outside the one. Ball walks and strolls to six. Touchdown, Turks. Mark, you see him lined up over the guard now. <laughs> he's, he's inside trying to line up on Costa to take advantage of these young offensive guards in the game for Maryland. They better put one of those low jack instruments on him to keep track of him if you're Maryland. He's got four tackles tonight. Not the ball down. Down. And Chris Long once again making his presence felt. So this is a good opportunity to launch that team right here. There's the play fake. <laughs> and a sack back at the 10-yard line, Chris Long. Gold last time he punted from around this distance was able to land the ball inside the five at about the two-yard line. We'll see what he does here. Bounces and once again gets it inside the 10-yard line. But a good decision. I mean, here they are again with Napoleon Dynamite <laughs> at quarterback coming out of their own end zone. Chris Turner once again with the unfavorable starting field position. The second worst starting field position of the night for them. Last time they started at the three, this time at the eight. Keon Lattimore in the backfield beside the quarterback Chris Turner. First down and ten. And that's going to be a safety. Chris Long locked his world. Watch right here. He's going to come inside over Burley, and then the guard's going to try to block him. He just beats him again on the inside move, Mark. Burley, the off guard, and did he plant wow. behind Chris Turner? Evaluated. And he talks about in the NFL how free agents make it. And he associates it out with Rockland. So Rockland's a valuable part of this Virginia program. Yeah, great point. On this defining drive, it's Mikkel Simpson in the backfield for Virginia. He started off number four on the depth chart tonight. Here he is again, getting to the left edge. And another first down for Simpson. All right, stand at the 40-yard line. Virginia down by five points, approaching five minutes to go. A little screen pass. Who else? Simpson going to work. Boy, he is using this field as his personal canvas tonight. Another first down. He's all year. A little guy, too, spe relatively speaking. But huge game and huge heart. Big determination. Down to the 30-yard line that time. Ten play of the drive coming up. Sewell. Off the bench and incomplete.
flag on the play at the on Maurice Covington, who's back from the broken hand. Last time they gave him the ball, they ran him between the tackles, a rather conservative maybe call. Here we go on fourth down. They got to get to the 10. Sewell fires. Complete. Simpson got it. But did he get the first down? Doesn't look like it. Depends on the spot. And he got a very fortuitous spot right at the marker, much to the dismay and disbelief of the Maryland players on the spot. It was his 12th catch. After Here comes. Review, the play stands as called on the field. First down. Wow. And Virginia has a first down and goal at the 10 yard line with. This game is rested squarely on the shoulders and a pressure. There's the pass that you called. Simpson stopped up short of the goal line at the one. Offset fullback in the game, Josh Zinberg, but he's the backup. Second and goal. Simpson over the top. No signal. And it might have been fumbled. It came loose. Touchdown. No. Virginia gets it. Does the ball cross the tip of the plane of that goal line. That's a touchdown. Right there. Video evidence confirms the ball in the field. Touchdown. Touch the beautiful job he has done. Rebuilding the psyche of this team. Lateral. Yeah. Yeah. Hooking lateral. And, yeah. Little rugby play. Harmlessly out of bounds. No time left on the clock. And that's going to be it. the Virginia Cavaliers behind Chris Long. A show of mutual respect coming from Darius Hayward Bay. Chris Long with a huge night defensively. And the Cavaliers come back in the fourth quarter and defeat Maryland. The final score 18 to 17 for the second consecutive week. They win a game by one point.